gonna show you how I like to set my cream makeup. I have oily skin, so I know you're probably thinking, why is she wearing cream? Because it's so much better. It really is it's so much better for my skin. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and set this bad boy. So get your setting spray that's gonna work for your skin type, and then you're just gonna go ahead and set your face. Because I'm oily, I'm just gonna make sure it's nice and saturated without dripping. Without dripping, that's the most important thing. Everything dry on your face. And if you have a different skin type, you can just check out my playlist because I have it per your skin type on how you should be setting your makeup. Basically what products are going to be good for you. If you are prone to crease under your eyes, you either want to A, go ahead and lay down that product with your finger just by tapping or use a damp beauty blender to go in and lay it down and then spray your finger or the damp beauty blender and, and tap the under eye just to go ahead and set it. Make sure you let everything dry before you go in with powder. Once it's dry, you're gonna go in with a powder puff. Because I have oily skin, this is what's gonna work the best for me. If you have dry skin, just use a big fluffy brush like the blush and bronzer brush, which looks like this, and then just go in with your powder, tap it off, and dust it on. But for combo and oily, we need a little bit more staying power. So we're gonna go ahead and tap and press it on. I'm not gonna do baking in this video. I do baking in another video if you'd like. But I'm just gonna tap and I go around my blush and I go under my eye last to go ahead and put any powder that's left over. That way I'm not putting heavy powder under my eyes because I'll crease. And I press really good in my T-zone area where I tend to get the most oily and then lightly go over top of my blush last. And that's it.